Ladies and gentlemen, the next cover model for Rugby Magazine. Uh, well, I, uh, you know, I'd gotten to a point with my beard being the size it was, and it was getting a lot of attention, and I figured I was going to shave at some point anyways. Why not uh, do something worthwhile with it? Well, no, no, somebody, somebody said to me that the, uh, the modern-day beard is the urban antler, so I like that one. Movember and your other charity that you're supporting here and the importance of that to you? Uh, yeah, Movember Canada was sort of trying to get behind uh, cancer research. I think cancer is something that's affected everybody in some way or another. Uh, and then the other one is Christchurch uh, Earthquake Relief Fund. Uh, I actually got a chance to visit Christchurch when I was visiting uh, New Zealand with my parents and um, the whole entire downtown district is actually shut down, which I wasn't expecting and sort of reaffirmed the, the need to, to have that in the charity. Well, I think this is probably the biggest thing on campus uh, we've ever had as far as uh, a thing like this. It's, it's neat It's neat for Adam to do this. I mean, it's just it's such a great thing that he actually hung on to the beard for an extra couple of weeks because I know he wanted to get rid of it. Well, I've seen some pretty big choppers he's had and, uh, and mustaches that have grown over one week or two weeks on tour. So, yeah, he had the potential. He's, uh, he's got the big beard uh, genetics. Oh, yeah, and he's still got some schooling to go on. You know, I hope he comes back at some point, but he's uh, right now, he's rugby is big for him, and that's his probably number one priority, but he's just uh, he's just done a fantastic job down there. I was so impressed with the way he played. You're watching the